Welcome to our tour of Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2013. My name is Rhonda Burke, and I'm the CRM Practice Manager at Endeavor Solutions. Today, we will explore the three modules of Dynamics CRM that are included when you launch the program for the first time. They include sales, marketing, and customer service. And while Dynamics CRM platform can be highly customized, it includes a very rich feature set right out of the box. I'm going to start our tour on the CRM Overview Dashboard. It includes information about our sales opportunities in the form of a sales funnel. There's a chart displaying our marketing efforts in the form of leads segmented by the source campaign. And another graph that includes currently open customer service cases displayed by the re representative who's working on them. At the bottom, you'll see a frame that contains a list of personalized activities. Those are scheduled for me to attend to. Like you see when driving your car, a dashboard gives you the current readings on what is happening inside your organization. Number of dashboards are configured out of the box, but a personal or departmental dashboard can easily be built through the interface. No programming skills required. Let's take a deeper look at our sales module and the elements that are included there. Navigating dynamic CRM is as simple as following the contextual header path across the top of your screen. By choosing the sales header, I can see the quick links to all the elements of the sales module that I require. The What's New section provides a quick overview of the most recent events that are of interest to me and pertain to the customers and activities that I'm working on. I can display my customer records by looking at accounts or contacts. I can also work with prospective customers and sales in the leads and opportunities area. Let's take a deeper look at the accounts. Many filtered views are available out of the box, including all accounts or even accounts that have had no orders in the past six months. The idea is to filter information to provide the most relevant view for the user. Forms are configured to hold relevant information in fields such as address or phone numbers, but also contain lists of associated records. We can see all the employees at a particular company, all the sales opportunities we have with them, or the customer service cases related to their business. Recent actions of the account are automatically added to a live feed and activities related to that account, such as meeting held or tasks completed, are clearly displayed. Like all information inside Dynamics CRM, records can be explored by simply clicking on a connection link. Contacts operate in much the same way as account, holding field information about individuals and providing an insight and history into the interactions with that person. Contacts in Dynamics CRM can be seamlessly synchronized with your Outlook contacts making sure that everyone in an organization has the most up-to-date information, whether it be at their desk, while working on their smartphone, or on a tablet. Let's take a look more closely at the sales features. First, we'll explore a lead record. Leads are used to hold prospective customers and opportunities until such time as they've been qualified. Like all records in CRM 2013, leads can be tracked and managed using the integrated process flow that resides at the top of the lead form. Social insight tools can provide more information about leads and can be used to synchronize current information like addresses or phone numbers. When a salesperson is satisfied that a lead meets all the qualifying criteria of their organization, simply selecting the Qualify button automatically creates a new account contact, and opportunity record from that lead. Duplication of effort is never required, and all the data collected at the lead stage stays with the account throughout the opportunity lifecycle. An opportunity differs from a lead in that it contains more detailed information about the prospective sale. Products can be added, quotes can be generated, and like all elements of dynamic CRM, related tasks and activities are seamlessly integrated and tracked. The process flow we first looked at in the lead form has carried over when we qualified our lead. The salesperson can use this flow to move the sale through the nurture and negotiation process right through to a successful close. Let's have a look now at the marketing elements of the program. 
Campaigns are included and can be used to track all the tasks and customer communications used within our marketing efforts. They can measure marketing effectiveness and be associated with leads and opportunities. Marketing lists can be created to segment prospects and customers, helping to deliver relevant and appropriate customer content and information. If we look at the service module, we can track customer service cases, tracking issues and resolution to ensure customer satisfaction. Each case can be used to create a knowledge base of articles so we can share our learnings and insights across the team. We can measure important details like response and resolution time, and ultimately we want to increase our team's effectiveness. Our service schedule allows us to track and manage the calendars of service technicians, giving increased visibility into our team members' time. A service schedule allows us to track and manage the calendars of our service technicians, giving increased visibility into our team members' time. Dynamic CRM provides companies with the ability to see a complete picture of their team's efforts, whether they work in sales, marketing, or customer care. The end result is a more effective organization, increased productivity, and ultimately, a more satisfied customer base.